This is the Chaurasta and there is this Durga Puja that is going on currently. It's the month of mid of October and it's early in the morning at around 8 o'clock. Um, so the Tea Valley Estate will open by 9.30 in the morning. So till then we'll have to spend some time and it's about half an hour of walk from this place. to Happy Valley Estate, Happy Valley Tea Estate to be precise and I have Shubham today so we have decided to go to the Tea Valley Estate but then it's too early in the morning right now uh, we thought of leaving at 6 o'clock in the morning yeah. yeah that was the plan Happy Valley Tea Estate will open by 9.30 so it's a lovely hiking trail it's almost like how it was like yesterday we have been to Japanese temple the same way it is another half an hour walk from the hostel Yeah, so it's going to be a steep descent and also while coming back there will be uh, too much of sunlight uh, to climb all the way up. So I would highly recommend if you guys are going around with your two-wheeler or a four-wheeler, that will be ideal. And if you do not like uh, hiking uphill, then this is not for you. On the day of Durga Puja, it's a special day for the Nepalis and here is a man whom I met with his three little kids. He has uh, three young girls, uh, they are wearing their traditional attire. Uh, today especially, uh, two of them, these two girls, they, ha they had a ceremony which, is, which in Nepal we call Gunyu Cholo. Today is the day when we give these young girls in our community uh -huh. to the Gurkha uh, girls. Uh, this uh, clothes, and after which they can wear, put on Saris and other stuffs okay. when they grew up or later in other festivals, and this thing is called Gunyu Choli. Okay, this is our Gunyu. Mm -hmm. Gunyu, this is Gunyu, mm -hmm. it's called Gunyu. This is Choli, mm -hmm. yeah, Cholo, Choli or Cholo. Okay, and this is uh, Pote, mm -hmm. and this is Lacha. Okay. Nice. Say hi. Yeah, I need you map. Namaste. Namaste. Thank you. Thank you so much. Your name, please. My name is uh, Satya Kam Chetri. Okay. And I am father of uh, these three girls here. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for Thank you. Thank, Thank you. Then. By the way, that's the Nepali uh, community and some of the community members and there is some ceremony that is that will ha be celebrated and uh, that's the local Nepali dress and he's the father of three kids, three little kids. <laughs> and they were helpful and uh, they shared that info. So if you're a Nepali, you'll definitely know that. By the way, while I wait for my breakfast, and I believe, I believe the breakfast is ready. Uh, and one more thing, the tea estate is closed because of the COVID, uh, but we can still go ahead and explore, but we cannot enter the plant where, the, where they do the tea tasting and all. What do you call, what do you call tea tasting, man? Tea tasting, okay. So where they do the tea tasting and also um, the processing, and the, basically they pack. So we are not allowed to that region, but at least we can go around the estate and enjoy our time here but we we plan to it's all the way down but we need some energy to go all the way down and come back uh, because everything is closed down there we thought of having some breakfast here i've ordered sandwich let me just take you around
look at this the view that you get to see from here we'll, we'll sit over here <laughs> look at this caffeine <laughs> Middle of the tea tea estate, uh, we have entered um, the area after having breakfast. It's a bit too sunny out here. Uh, easily, you know, you can get sunburn. But the view is just awesome. Um, by the way, I'm walking downhill and climbing up or going back. It's definitely going to be challenging, but that should be fine. At least the view is beautiful, and you can go around. the processing of tea and also the packing is done here there is a entry ticket of 100 if you want to enter that place but because of covid reasons the plant is closed for visitors and there is no point in you can still pay 100 and go inside but uh, as of now because it is closed and there is no processing and also because it's durga puja time and there is vacation um, so there is nothing being done inside of the plant so there is no point in visiting so we are just going around there is a village uh, if you go further down and the view from that place is considered to be the most beautiful. I guess, yeah. Yeah. I think it's further down. <laughs> Here is a road as you can see. So guys, as you can see, over there is the tea processing plant and there is this village and also the town is on top. So our hostel is somewhere far over there and you have the Peace Pagoda and the Japanese temple to the right, right behind these trees. So it's in the opposite direction by the way, the Peace Pagoda and the Japanese temple and the tea estate. So you might need more time to cover. And earlier, you don't have to wait till 9.30 to visit this place uh, even though the visiting time is uh, from 9.30 onwards it is only to visit the plant which has an entry ticket of 100 uh, to to visit this place or to visit this village there is a, a road and also if you want to visit the there is another road connecting this place and that is right in front of the plant um, I, there is no entry ticket to enter this village or even if you want to just explore the estate but if you want to visit the plant or the processing center or the package center then there is an entry ticket of 100 and uh, to come to this place i would highly recommend you guys to come in the morning early morning would be the best time it's just around um, 10 o'clock in the morning and there is so much sunlight here and climbing up all the way up will be will definitely be a challenge if you are not used to hiking the road continues further down all the way uh, to the valley below but we will be stopping here because I need to go back and connect to my office uh, I need to continue with my office work so before my office work starts I'll be exploring this is what I do when I'm working from mountains so let's enjoy the view taken a different route that is a star road we just wanted to explore this place a little bit so we decided to uh, take the tar road which is a little bit far away but 
uh, we don't have to take the same route. I usually prefer not to take the same route and so that we can cover more places. And the view is just breathtaking. So we have taken the inner route, there is a local route which uh, you will come to know only if you ask the local lights, it will not show up in Google Maps. <sighs> or else if you take the road, then it's going to be at least a kilometer more. But this is a steep climb. <sighs> and it's hard to walk around with the mask on. It was a good hike though, even though we took the shortcut, it's almost like a vertical climb. Just taking a short break of less than two minutes and then we'll have to continue further. By the way, I'm going on some of the food trek next week. So this is an ideal practice trek, I can say. Practice hike in the local Darjeeling tea estate. It's almost a steep climb. It's almost equivalent to climbing a kind of pass or something. Uh, or it's like running for five kilometers and the kind of breathlessness you feel that's exactly how I'm feeling right now just absolutely I mean, we're just exploring the place and there's no Google Maps we're just exploring asking the localites which way to go all that we know is if you go further on top there is this highway finally managed to reach, reach the road and it's gonna be at least we are in the roadside. We are not lost. We might have to take a taxi or we'll have to walk. Yeah. The steep climb and we are now entering the mall market. Let me take you through this place. So you get all these things, Probably. like the key bunch and everything. Maybe the bag. I'll come here again. So this is Chaurasta. And we have just completed the Tea Valley hike. It was uh, it was a wonderful place to visit in the middle of the Tea Estate and a steep climb. We took the taxi while coming back. So we are now heading back to the hostel and I'll be continuing with my office work. Cause it don't get old 